Hi, everybody, and welcome to What's Happening at the Library in November. I'm Sarah. And I'm Elizabeth. And we have some cool stuff going on yeah, in November. A good, yeah. a good big change is coming this November. Yes. The Would changing you, seasons come changes at the library, that's too. Right. Would you like to talk about our biggest change yeah. coming up at the library in November? We are welcoming a new director. His name is uh, John Jackson, and he comes from the Foley Public Library in Alabama. And he's going to be starting this month at the Campbell County Public Library, and we're, we're really excited yeah. to welcome him aboard. And yeah. It'll be good to have um, a leader again. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> We've been leaderless for a little bit. Brandy's done a great job, though. Shout out to Brandy Elder, the HR director. She's taken over interim um, yeah, she in this was time, fabulous. so she was great. We loved working with her, but it's nice. it'll be nice to have somebody in the building every day and... and um, so yeah, we're looking forward to it. Yeah, so. we're looking forward to get settled and yeah. the library's moving on. So yeah, so um, that'll be that's gonna be a big change. But also coming up, we have the Library Foundation Quilt Auction that we do every year. Um, so that's running November first through the seventeenth, and um, it'll be in the atrium like normal at the library in Gillette. And um, so it's a silent auction, so you can come and see all the really cool. We have some amazing pieces that were donated this year. Um, they'll, so they'll be hanging up and, and um, on tables in the atrium, and you can come and bid and um, get some. They're great for Christmas gifts. They're great mm -hmm. for, um, there's a lot of uh, throws this year. So if you're looking for a nice quilt throw on your couch, that's a great one. Um, there's some really pretty wall hanging quilts. So um, they're good Christmas presents. So whatever you're um, looking for for a quilting piece, come in and check those out starting on November 1st. And we have some two Wyoming authors coming to the library this month. Um, one is Roger McDaniel. He's coming Sunday, November 5th at 2 p.m. And he is going to talk about his latest book, Profiles in Courage, Standing Against the Wyoming Wind. So he's coming and then we have um, returning is Kurt Wendelbow. And he's coming Sunday, November 19th at 2. And he writes mystery books and he's going to be talking about his sixth mystery book. And I don't know if it's a series. Yep. It's, and it's like a Western flair mystery. It's, it's like the death, the death series. So it's like death under yeah. another. So the, the next one that's out this year. So that's always great. He's a great uh, speaker. So if you ever, if you have a chance to come out and hear him, that's, I would take it. Um, we are also doing in the teen room a Hunger Games escape room. So we have kind of a Hunger Games theme going on on in November because the new, it's a prequel. The Hunger Games prequel movie is coming out. Um, so the Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes movie is releasing on the 17th. So the Dean Room is doing some really cool Hunger Games themed stuff throughout the month. So on the 15th, they're doing an escape room and that's, um, you have to come in, sign up for a slot or call the Teen Room for a, a slot for that. So that's Wednesday, November 15th, 3.30 to 5.30. And then they're doing a Hunger Games movie marathon on November 24th and 25th starting at 10.30 on those days. So that's a lot of fun. So yeah, I didn't know there was a prequel coming out. Yeah, yeah. So the book came out, I don't remember, a couple years ago, and then yeah, the movie's coming out. So they're Very they're kind good. of doing some some themed stuff along with that. Great. Yeah. Um, some of our monthly programs that we have this month are our volunteer reference attorney. He's coming, they are coming Thursday, November 2nd, 2 to 4. And then our CCPL book club. This month they're reading The Midnight Library by Matt Haig. That is going to be Saturday, November 18th at 2. And those books are available at the reference desk, so you can come and check one out and then come for the discussion posts. Um, and yeah, there's a lot of other fun programs. It looks like the WBL is having a lot of fun events this yeah. month as well. Walking, the teens are doing a walking tacos and flashlight tag. I think that sounds fun. I was like, I want to go I be could a do team. That. <laughs> I want to be young again. I want to be a team. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I don't. <laughs> but if you are a teen, I would suggest coming out to that because that looks like a lot of fun. Hard teen years. That's right. <laughs> Don't want to it'll, it'll make your teen years better. Go do walking tacos and flashlight deck. Um, so that's November 17th at the Wright Branch Library. Um, they're also doing Reading Dragons starting on November 20th. Um, so they're inviting children of all ages to read, collect, and play with WBL's Reading Dragons. Um, so you're picking up a starter kit that includes a tracker, three starter cords, and instructions on how to earn dragons by reading. So if you're a dragon nice. collector, check out Right Branch starting on November 20th. Um, but yeah, other than that, you can check our calendar. It's on our website. It's also printed in our at, at both libraries. So um, anything we didn't talk about today, you can kind of check out 
Um, the program's coming up in November, and we will see you in December. Thanks.